K-I-L-R Killer Games Hey, welcome once again to a, a fun video with uh, Gil Giller Giller Killer Gamer and a balloon and a balloon that's got Nerd Gamer 2K right inside there. of it inside of that balloon just floating away up 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 and we're gonna be playing Rocket Ranger and oh yes we can definitely get owned with this one so we'll just blow that away so save the girl beat the bad guys most games this is Rocket Ranger from uh, the company Cinemaware uh, uh, they yeah. were very uh, famous for uh, back in the day when they were making games for the uh, Amiga, they tried to make them like movies, like interactive uh, little movies with uh, stuff. I mean, they were ahead of their time, I must say. So this is 1988. It's an action-adventure game. And it was originally for the Commodore Amiga. They ported this over to the Commodore 64, to DOS, a uh, bunch of other things. Uh, here we go. DOS 6, C64, Apple 2G's, Atari ST, and then uh, not too long ago, the NES. Oh, wow. Um, or the Nintendo Entertainment System. I think probably they're meaning like uh, um, like the Game Boy DS, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, this uh, game is inspired from the classic 1950s sci-fi serials. As you can tell just by looking at the cover there. Yeah. And this is also inspired by the Rocketeer comic books. So we're going to go ahead and get to this and see what we got. Whiteness. We're booting up our game Amiga to see what we got other than a white screen. Ah, and a blue screen. Amiga DOS. 1.3 released. Commodore Amiga. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. Workbench. Workbench, yes. And blackness. Workbench was the Amiga version of desktop way before Windows had a desktop. That Windows 3.1. I think it was kind of the same. It is 1940. There's Hitler <laughs> taken over the world. Oh yeah, that's a Nazi symbol. Hitler's goose-stepping hordes are sweeping across Europe, virtually unchallenged. Millions cry out in anguish as the black stain of Nazism corrupts an unprepared world. The stain grows larger and more deadly. And we just missed all that. France succumb? Only one person has a chance to stop these villains. One person can strike the decisive blow. That is you. And you are about to become Rocket Ranger. Nerd Gamer 2K. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Now we wait for the movie to start. And we're waiting. Anytime now. Wait for it. Yeah. I like the clouds. Whee! <laughs> Rocket Ranger! Oh, I guess the game's over. Yeah, game's over. Nothing else to see. No, they want to make sure that they... That you all knew who did this stuff. Totally. Even though we're not paying any attention. But the music is by Bob Lindstrom. Yeah, I don't know who that is. Don't know. But I like the music. Bob Land... Ross did a lot. There's a lot of Bobs and Robs and stuff. 
Do 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 do. And now we have the never mind. Now we have to wait. Top secret. We're working on something. We're in some top secret laboratory. Kind of flipping the, the pencil on the pen there. You look kind of different there, Nerd Gamer 2K. Yeah. Fort Dix. We're in Fort Dix, New Jersey. And we're puzzling over something. And then there's a loud whining noise. And the room vibrates. And stuff shows up on your desk, apparently. And you're, you're screaming inside your own head, saying, This isn't possible. Uh. What? You got a rocket pack, something, a watch, it looks like, and a gun. Five objects, rocket pack, pistol, strange looking wristwatch, a disc labeled Secret Dakota Wheel, huh. and a book with the title Rocket Pack Instructions. 100 years ago, the Nazis won World War II. It was a mistake, but you can correct it. Oh, yeah. But Wait. If that's, <laughs> if that's how history was, uh, I'm like... Know it's a mistake, I don't know. All right. Odo Barnstoffen's daughter, Jane. Exactly as the message predicted. All right, there's an airship. And we got a... Scoop up the rocket pack. Okay, so here is the joystick here. The Nerd joystick gamer. of life. So I think you want to hit click number one. Did click. I oh. pressed it. Maybe we have to wait. Oh. Maybe. Maybe we're loading up. Anytime. Well, we're pressing the joystick button. I've clicked. Oh, here we go. Um. Whoops. Oh. Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> Resume. Yay! There we go. Okay. So. Okay. So the button's working, right? Yeah. Okay. Um. Let's go to fuel depot. Okay. Um can you go back? No no, there's only one or two. There's only two buttons. Um Oh. Okay. War room? Yeah, it looks like a war room. Why are there only two buttons? Because that's all the joystick has is two buttons. Okay, we're reporting to Bulldog Brady. Um, General orders his top five agents to place under your direct command. Agents who infiltrate report back with clues. Countries change color when you organize resistance and flash red while the Nazis attempt to occupy. Agents who maintain a high profile change color to white and carry out their orders more quickly they run a risk of being discovered. Multiple agents placed on a country perform more efficiently but have a higher chance of blowing their cover. Okay, so they all have something to say, so click on one of them and go up to report. Lunarium traces blowing in from east. Possible origin Nazi base. Uh, I guess just click out of that. Go continue. Click on one of those other guys. Leermeister threatening to destroy Stone Tower at Jericho. May seek to erect base in the area.
to ski. Hmm. So what's the point of this game? Well, we're trying to stop the Nazis, apparently. Situation critical. An SS colonel named Leermeister plans to win the war with Lunarium bombs. Bomb factory here. But Lunarium coming from base on moon must be destroyed. Suggest you build rocket with stolen Nazi parts. Okay, so that's in Germany, so we need to go to Germany. Um, and one last one. Scandinavia. Bribe local official to get something. Repeat factory is here. Oh, okay, let's go there. Okay, so that's in Scandinavia. So, click. Oh, they just took over Russia. Um, continue. Um, move your joystick over there to exit. Okay, so we need to look and see how much fuel we need. So we're going from the U.S. to go to, uh, yeah, fuel depot. And as we try to figure out here how much fuel we need, because that's what the, uh, um, that's what the decoder wheel is for. Oh, let's see. Origin is USA. Oops. U. Let's see. USA. Okay. So we're going to Scand. Scandinavia. Which is 37. Okay. So let's put. 80 inside the rocket pack. Okay. And then we'll go down to take off. Take off. Click button to transfer Unarium. Okay, so just click. Click a button. Okay, so rocket chamber, you're going to put um, 37. Gotta make it right, otherwise we wind up landing somewhere. Okay, so that's what we want. RR, that's us, Rocket Ranger. We hoist the rocket pack. Press the joystick button simultaneously with each footstep to gain speed. When you reach takeoff velocity, the rocket pack will beep. And then push the joystick forward. Okay, so. Awesome! Yeah! We're taking off. Now, the more fuel you have, the harder it is to take off, so... <laughs> <laughs> Go get him, Nerd Gamer! Yeah! Get the Nazis! Oh, that's oh. cool. Wait a minute, where in the world are we going? That's not Scandinavia. It's in the middle of the ocean. I looked at it right, right? Yes, I did. Now what? We're waiting for it to load up. Oh, better luck next time, I guess. <laughs> so long, Grandma. The end. What a lovely game.
Um, I guess we didn't put in the right code. But that's what it said. There's like two different versions of this game. There is like a um, US version and a PAL version. And I could have sworn we had the US version. Do I press continue? Yeah, press continue. Let's see if we can do better on this. Go back to field depot, right? Oh no, it starts over again. Go to war room. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven down. Mm, we already read that. So do I, oh, it's in different places now. Yeah, it's different every time that you play. That's kind of cool, though. I think I might have the... Oops. I might have the right codes. We'll take a look here. Um, yeah, click on all of them. Nothing to report. We may have to move him somewhere. Nothing to report. I got nothing. All right. Um. <laughs> okay. Whoops. I think he's gonna say the same thing. Oh yeah, he's doing the bomb factory there. So you can see where this is Germany bomb factory found. Oh yeah. I think that's the last place we want to go. Maybe I don't know. All right. So click on one of the little guys. Um. Change orders? We can't change orders? Meh. Huh. Continue? I wonder what's here. Yeah. Oh. There's supposed to be a way we can move them. Click, click on a different one. Change cover? No, that just makes them high risk. Oh, go to agents. There we go. Alright, continue. Okay, now, oh, oh, they all, all might have something to report. Put them on a different, um, yeah, go ahead and see what it says. Near its Nazi base, apparently north. Okay, so go ahead and go up to agents. Now we got two. Now go to continue. Now move north. Nope, nope, the country to the north. That little down. Okay, not him, but the one right next to him. Nope. Yeah, there we go, right there. Well then that wouldn't be a country. That is a country. Um, click agents. Awesome. Okay. Continue. And then we'll go to the guy next to him. Secret base. Bribed. Okay. Alright. We got our rocket base, so click off of him. Go over there to the other one that's blinking. Maybe he got bombed. Nope. A Nazi base south of my current location. Alright, let's get him out of there. Hit agents. And... Oh, no, you put two people there. Go back. And again. There we go. Now go south. There, that one. Let's put someone there. And let's, yeah, let's put one right there. Okay. Okay, they're going to infiltrate. Okay, so click on the rocket base. Okay, so that is Columbia. Okay, go back to exit, and let me see what the thing for Columbia is. Oh, I had a map here. I could have just used that. 
Colombia. All right. So that'd be U.S. to Colombia. U.S. to Colombia. It should be twenty-six. So let's put eighty in there. That's what we did the last time, and it was pretty decent to take off with. Take off? Yeah, take off. Yeah, it's 26. I just want to make sure I read it right. Now, this doesn't work. Uh, there is that blimp in the middle that we can go. That's where we go after the scientist or his daughter or whatever. But maybe we'll try that on another one. Maybe. Blah, 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 blah. Although I like the music. <laughs> okay. Not a very good takeoff there. Oh, oh, mm, uh, shake my head. Yay. There you go. Hopefully we are now going where we should be going. Yeah, hopefully. Guess we'll find out here in a moment. It looks like it. Although, wouldn't that be kind of scary being in a jetpack? <laughs> Could be, but he's the hero. I know, but flying that long, I mean, that'd be like five hours. All right, the rocket lab. With luck, we can build a moon rocket from captured parts, taken from different labs and assembled at Fort Dix. There's a guard, and he aims a rifle at you, and then he lowers it. Okay, so apparently we're going to get into a fist fight. We're going to put up our dukes. I don't get it. Um, I think the with the hitting, you, you push up and uh, the, the button, and you do like an uppercut or something, and then there's like right, left... Hit your button there. Um, it's not even hitting him. Yeah, let me let me see. <laughs> He's like dancing. Uh, let's see. Ooh. You have to hold it. Oh, that's why. Well, which one is us on the right side? Oh, that's a Nazi. Yeah, we're we're, we're the guy that. Oh. So we are the blue health. Yeah, we're the blue health. So, yeah, so you have to push the button and hold it. Okay, I didn't know that. And look and look where he's uh, pointing. So up is the um, face, and then down is the stomach. Sound looks sounds really good. Totally. All right, so there you go. So we got ourselves a rocket piece. Okay, so the parts. British submarine. Okay, so we have to go destroy the moon base. Once we get the rocket in the place. Apparently the guy is scold. 
scared. All right. So that's the worst. That's if we ran out of fuel or something. All right, pick destination. So we have 54 in our linarium tank. And we don't have a whole lot of fuel. So I think the best thing to do is just to head right back. So it's just 26. Same as what we used before. So we're going back? Yep. Heading back to Fort Dix. In the U.S.? In the U.S., yeah. I wonder if it actually exists. Yeah, it does. That's cool. So he's going to land. Hey, it's a flag. And a water tower. And a horse. Huh? Over there. Oh, yeah. All right, now let's go to the rocket lab. Let's see what we have. That's a big piece. This is our checklist. So we have to have 500 linarium, um, the components. We're not quite there yet. All right, so let's get out of this. Let's go to the war room. You have a moment. It's loading. I am not used to loading. Oh, they all have something to say. Let's see what it is. I think he's dead. Stupid Americans! Your useless agent has been executed. Oh. Bow to the blah, 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 blah. of National Socialism. Heil Hitler. <laughs> Isn't that heel? No, that's Heil. Well, talk to the other ones. Let's see what he says. Have uncovered plans to fortify Nazi shipping interests with complex near straits of someplace. <laughs> now, river possible shipping lane for Linarium. Egypt. Why don't we click on Egypt to see if we can move them? I don't know where Egypt is. Egypt is there, I think. Oh, actually, if you look at the map, that'll tell me. Yep, that's Egypt. There? No, the one right next to the right, yep. Let's get our one guy to Germany. I think there's one over there. This guy? No, I think. No, never mind. He's gone. Maybe yeah, they he's killed been him gone. too. He's been gone. He was the first guy to get gone. It's been a year. Wow, that's not good. That was fast. All right, let's move some of these other guys around. Let's move him. Because right now we don't have any place to go. We'll move him. Let's move him south. Like, I guess you... Yeah, let's put it up there north. In Canada. Canada! Let's find out what he's found out. Nearest Nazi base, apparently north. Okay, get out of there. Click agents. And let's move them north. Bet you that's where we need to go. You mean like to fly there? Yeah, we'll just wait for a moment. So then we can figure out what place that is and then figure out how much fuel we need. Right, exactly. In the meantime. So that's Algeria. And I'll just look up the fuel right now. That shouldn't be too hard. Oh, it's the first one on the list. Uh, 61. Ooh, we're going to have to carry some fuel with us. 
I would say probably 130. That's a lot. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, too much there. The Nazis have taken Dr. Barnstoff and Jane to the secret bomb factory in Germany. Well, apparently Jane's going to be used in a new mind control machine. So we need to go to Germany? Uh. I don't think we can. Not yet. But it's saying we have to. Well, how much fuel does it take to go to Germany? Um, I don't know, but I think Germany, I don't think we're ready for Germany yet because we have to do all the other things first. I mm. don't know. Well, let's try 61. Let's see what, what happens. I think the first time I played this game I had clicked SOS so I wasn't using all that fuel. Probably best. But you lose you lose some time though when you do that. Yeah, because we're losing a lot of fuel. I didn't even press the up button. Oh no, the engine the engine runs high, so it's, it gets to a certain point and then it and then it tries to take off. You can see how much harder it is. <laughs> is it cuz it's heavier? Yeah, because of the fuel that's in there. <laughs> Are you kidding me? We're never gonna take off! Gee whiz, this linearum is heavy stuff! After two long months of hard work, oh jeez! Your, your your final reward at the last you are airborne. Takes notes, pal. <laughs> Take a few extra steps after you hear the beep. What beep? Zeppelin fleet is moving much too quickly. Crack Nazi fighter squadron has you in their sights. Okay, so we're grabbing our radium pistol and we're gonna shoot some airplanes apparently. <laughs> oh. Oh, we got hit. Twice. This is impossible. Um. Red, I think you got hit one too many times. I wonder why. I found country. Wonder where we're at. Well, let's pick destination. Maybe we'll just fly to Germany. What the hey? Okay, so we're in Libya. Yeah, we're.
we're in Libya. So, um, Libya to Germany. How do you even do that decoder thing? You just you have to turn it until all the numbers match up. All right, it's so confusing. Second. Yeah, it's a little confusing. All right, where's Libya? Libya is down here. So when you bought the game, did you? I mean, like when you, like, would you be sent an actual twisty thingy? Oh, it's all in the box. It's all in the box. Um, okay, we need ten. Luckily. To like push it to its death. Is linarium like plutonium? <laughs> yeah, and you have to go 55 miles per hour. <laughs> no wonder or why. 88 100. miles per hour. That's it. Yeah, fi where'd you get 51 from? Uh, fi 55. I was thinking, can I drive 55? Yeah, it's 88 miles per hour. 1.21 1 1 gigawatts! Oops. Oops! Huh? Uh, apparently nothing's in Germany. Um... SOS! Yes, I know, SOS. Help! Oh, that's that watch thing. Yeah, that's his watch. Apparently. U.S. Navy. A very big party. Nazis are having a party. Nightly poker games. <laughs> well, I guess I'll just check the war room. Maybe more people died. Yeah. Well, he's gone. <laughs> well, we still have him. Country infiltrated. Have discovered major Nazi munitions dumped here. But we were already there. We got shot down, though. Oh, yeah. So I'm guessing we need to go to that other place. Local partisans report Nazi complex at wherever that is. Please help locate. I don't know where that's at. And the Nazis are just about taking over the entire world. Well, I guess. Shoot. What do we do now? Local fuel dump. Heavily guarded. Only one option. Recommend surprise aerial attack. Uh, not good at aerial attack, apparently. So I guess we're going... Is that Canada? I guess we'll go to yeah. Canada, then. There's apparently something there. Um, right now. Let's find out. Canada is five down. As I... Whoops. Turn things around here. All right, it is number. F that's not the right number. Thirteen. Oh, we got we got fuel. Um, let's see. Yeah, that's good. Take off. Hey, at least we should be able to take off this time. How much? Thirteen. Maybe.
<laughs> She's like, no, I'm going to get up into the sky if it's the last thing I do. Ah, there we go. Company C. Oh. I like the music. I think we have more aerial flights. Uh, do you want me to try that? All yes. Because right. <laughs> I would die. She's like, I do not want to try this again. Let's see what I can do here. Dang, I got hit. It's like impossible to shoot them. I got two. Got two of them. Whoa, whoa. Whoa. Gotta be careful because you, you don't want to be in their line of sight. Ow, got it. Hit me again. Three strikes are out. Better not get hit this, this, this next time. Looks like there's only one left. Only one left. I got him, but oh, it what didn't go red. Maybe it's okay. Maybe. All right, we just got fuel. Talons. So we just got a whole bunch of fuel then. Cool. All right. I guess we go destination and then put 13. Yeah, yeah, meanwhile, the Nazis have just about conquered the world. Chapter 3. We received a mole in Germany, a lunar mine near the Sea of Tranquility. That's on the moon. Okay, Dr. Barnes up and his daughter to a desert rocket base where a spaceship is waiting to take them to the moon. On the moon, the Nazis will force them to accelerate lunarium, lunarium production. Oh wow. But we never even made a spaceship yet. We have to locate the desert base too. I have no idea where that's at. Well, why don't we kind of pause our game and die? We'll <laughs> we'll pick this up on a on another uh, another show. Well, thanks for tuning in, and I don't know. Keep your helmets on, I guess. 